We're joined by the legend that is Chris Barry, aka Rimmer, aka Bonehead, aka Old Iron Balls. Is that is that a, a I roll like call? One, yeah. for you? Oh, I like that one. Yeah. yeah. How's today going for you? Today, Liverpool, a good crowd for Red Dwarf. Well, yeah, I haven't been back to Liverpool since really since a uh, dedicated Red Dwarf uh, convention at the Adelphi, I don't even know when, but a long time ago. So uh, it's good to, good. To, I, did, I was thinking about trying to come back last year with Robert and Dan, but I didn't make it. But I'm brilliant to be back now. We're incredibly busy. One of the favorite things I love about Red Dwarf was always your Scouse accent when you did an impression of him. Hey, Could hey, you hey, hey, give us a little blast of it? But you're just an impersonation of Craig. It's sort of like this. It's sort of always tired, like, you know, and then doing this sort of stuff. Hey, hey, Rimmy, Rimmy. And, so goes on. and also, a lot of people might not remember that you were one of the, the, the founding voices on Spitting Image. What were some of your favourite characters that you, you did back in the day on, on Spitting Image, Chris? Well, back in the day, my favourite characters were, uh, you know, I mean, they're the ones that I sort of brought to the show, which would have been uh, extraordinary. Uh, the late, great David Colburn, uh, one nil. No, it's come out again. Uh, and, of course, the uh, Will. Uh, what's my name again? Ronald Reagan? Well, it's been quite remarkable to meet you, sir. <laughs> Thank you very Thanks much. Extraordinary. Yes. Thank you very much. Chris. All the best, Jack. Right, and here we are. We're joined by the the amazing Danny John Jules. Ow! Ow. With a pair as well. Yeah. He's he's keeping his five a day going. Danny, how are you finding this here at Liverpool, the, the Comic Con? How's it going for you? Yeah, good. I, I always have a good time when I come to Liverpool Comic Con. Um, you know, Scouts is a all, all, whatever they do, they do it. Full, to the fullest. They don't hold back. And and why should you? Not science fiction is not about holding back. But the cat is getting a lot more great storylines and he's kinda of, and his wardrobe was looking really badass. That must yeah. have been good for you. Well, you know, the, the, the script is king and whatever that Doug writes on that script is what goes out there. And uh, the storylines are it's difficult to lead a storyline with the cat because he's a he's a reactor. That's where his strength is. I've got to say, I've always had a fantasy that I wanted to do with Danny John Jules. I'm not going to beat you, but can we have like a little spin move competition? 